What's up, my Netflix bros? What's up to my RT and Spirit community? What's up to anyone that's watching my channel for the first time? Watching this video for the first time. I want to welcome you. Welcome you to some good energy. Welcome you to some high vibrational frequency. And welcome you so we can turn the fuck up. Today, the sun's out. I'm feeling good. Your boy got his shirt off because the sun's out. Sun's out, guns out. You know what I'm saying? It's been about 10 days since I've seen the sun. So I'm really excited and I feel really good and I feel charged up. So today, we're going to be talking about taking a peek. Is it wrong to take a peek? Is it going to help me? You know, on my no Feb journey, taking a peek because I had a conversation with a guy and we was talking about taking a peek. How take a, taking a peek can be, can be a potential threat to your properly rebooting on your no Feb journey. Because see, the thing is, you're potentially setting yourself up for failure if you think that you can take a peek or if you could think that you could look at something sexual that something artificial see the thing is we're trying to get away from artificial stimulus you know what i'm saying we want to be stimulated organically with a real person so if you're constantly looking at the sexual images if you constantly if you think that you can take a peek and nothing to happen then you're pretty much setting yourself up for failure because nine times out of ten when guys take peaks when they haven't developed the willpower the inner strength and even and even why do you even want to play with fire why do you even want to take a peek so you got to get that thought out first so you got to ask yourself why do i want to take a peek is it me that want to take a peek or is it my brain that want that stimulus just how i was talking about yesterday with the shemales how like my brain wanted a stimulus a higher dopamine stimulus you know what i'm saying so does your brain want a certain stimulus that you're not getting from an art from that you're not getting from an organic stimulus you know what i'm saying so like just like when you complete a task or when you do a good job at work or when you achieve something, you be, your brain rewards you with a little bit of dopamine. But if you're constantly taking peaks and looking at porn and fapping, you're getting overwhelmed with too much dopamine. So your brain is actually wanting you to take a peek because it knows, it knows it, your, your subconscious knows you better than you. So your subconscious is going to play with you and say, hey, we're going to do this take a little peek and next thing you know you're in a certain you're back in that certain cycle of like fapping and looking at porn so because i had like i had a conversation with a guy i'm not sure if i mentioned this already but i have a conversation with a guy we was talking about taking a peek and how he took a peek and how he ended up relapsing and he just you know you're just playing with you're playing with fire so why would you want to play with fire so and taking a peek is similar to like setting yourself up Okay, you know how like you you know how like you sit on on a, a uh, ledge like this, and it's a big tub of water, and it's a bullseye, and people are throwing balls at the bullseye. You know what I'm saying? They might hit it, they might not, but if they hit it, you fall into the water. And let's just say you didn't want to get just say you didn't want to get wet that day, but you sat on the ledge. You set yourself up for potential failure. That's the same thing with taking a peek. You know what I'm saying? So why would you even want to set yourself up for a potential? failure for potential relapse for nothing you know what i'm saying you know you know how pussy looks you know how the ass looks you know how getting your dick suck look you know how having sex look you know how all that stuff looks so ask yourself why do i even want to take a pic where is this thought coming from is this thought me do i want to get back into this cycle why am i playing with fire you know what I'm saying? Why do I why do I even want to take a peek? Instead of taking a peek, why don't you go to the mall? Why don't you go to the store and actually talk to a girl? So that's how you kind of stop that. Or you don't even have to do that. You can just do your your daily normal routines and habits, whatever you do throughout your day. Just do that. You know what I'm saying? Dismiss that thought and instead of implanting a instead of implanting a picture or a video of some type of sexually explicit um woman implant like a book or like a like one of my videos or just your goals implant that into your subconscious man because we're trying to clean out our subconscious we're trying to reprogram our subconscious into prosperity wealth abundance high vibration high frequency and all that 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 porn and the twerking is, is low vibing stuff you know what i'm saying it's going to get you back caught up in certain cycles you feel me so you ask yourself why do i want why do i even want to take a pic a peak and is this is in this and if this voice is actually me saying this or is this voice that's telling me you're trying to get me caught up back in a certain cycle you know what i'm saying because it, it's just it's even though we feel like and it comes a point in time where you're like at like day 30 day 50 day 60 and be like taking a peak isn't bad because i'm going to admit like 
I don't take peeks at porn or twerking videos, but I have I have looked at um, fine women on Instagram. See, the thing is with me, I used to be I used to get I used to get like super stimulated when I looked at like fine girls' faces. You know what I'm saying? I get a boner and then I end up wanting to fap and stuff and I go look at porn or turkey videos, whatever. But for me, I don't even get that. I don't even get a boner anymore. I don't even get stimulated or turned on by looking at a fine girl picture. So I have looked at fine girl um, pictures on Instagram. Does it mean I'm still going to do it? No, but I am admitting that I have. And I used to look at fine girl pictures and get stimulated. I remember I used to, I remember I talked to another no fat bro and he was telling me that he doesn't get stimulated or he doesn't get aroused or he doesn't get an erection when he looks at fine girls or twerking videos or porn. I'm like, man, that's great. That, that lets that lets you that's telling me that you're properly rebooting, you're properly rewiring. He's saying that he's not getting turned on by artificial stimulus, but he's getting turned on by organic stimulus. And he was saying he's able to have erections with real girls. Before he wasn't able to have erection with real girls. He was only able to have erections with porn or twerky videos and stuff like that. So that's the thing. You can get to the point where you're not stimulated from looking at porn. It, it just, it's nothing. Like, I can, I'm not even going to look at porn. I don't even want to test it. I have looked at fine women on Instagram like their face, but I don't even want to look at porn or twerky videos. I'm not even going to play with fires. There's really no reason to even look at it because I know what it is, and I don't even need to test. I don't even need to test that out. I'm I'm good. I'm on day what 35 or whatever. I don't need to implant something sexual into my mind. I don't need to implant any of that any of those thoughts in my mind because once you start playing with fire, next thing you know the fire fucking just gets big just like it, just like the wildfires in California. You know what I'm saying? So we have to extinguish the fire, which is the peaking, the thoughts, the sexual images and stuff like that. So I highly recommend you guys if you're thinking about taking a peek, don't take a peek. Why take a peek? You know what it looks like. You're trying to reboot. Just like if you're drinking alcohol, why are you going to take a little sip? If you take a little sip, it feels good. You're going to be like, man, it's not bad. You know what? It's not that bad. I could take another sip. Next thing you know, you, you have three, four, five, six shots. Next thing you know, you're doing things that you wasn't going to do because you're not in your right state of mind. Just like when you look, just like when you take a peek, you're starting to get dopamine. You're starting to, in, you're starting to enter in different states of your mind of not, lower consciousness. Because have you ever taken a peek and you'd be like, it's not that bad. Next thing you know, you're fapping because you don't care. You're in a certain state in your mind, a certain awareness that you really don't care. But imagine you... Like right now, you care. You're in a certain state in your mind. You're in a certain dimension, a certain frequency right now because you care. When you don't care, like when you don't care for your well-being, how can you be in a higher state of consciousness? How can you be in a higher awareness? You know what I'm saying? Like you have to, you have to care somewhat to even be in that certain type of consciousness. You know what I'm saying? When you reach higher into your higher self, you're, you're, you who you are, your higher self cares about your well-being. It cares about humanity. It cares about the earth. It cares about the animals. It just cares because it is your higher self versus your lower self. So that's the thing. When you're looking at certain images or certain shit like that, and you find yourself not caring, that lets you know that this is not who you want. This is not who you want. This is not a thought that you want to entertain, and that's not who you want to entertain, which is what you're becoming in that particular moment. You feel me? So I really hope that I've explained like taking a peek, how it could be detrimental, and how you can just desensitize yourself, well, resensitize yourself by not looking at um, all those twerky videos and stuff, because, like, right now, I'm on day 35, even though I'm being into spirituality and, like, being in the now and breathing and meditating and journaling and doing all these things and barefoot in nature, even though I'm doing all these things, I just feel, like, holding in my semen, holding in my life force, I just feel more powerful. I feel more aware. I'm connecting better. I'm just, I'm just more grounded. You know what I'm saying? Even you, some of you guys were like, man, you look more grounded. Like I'm just rising. You know what I'm saying? Every single day I'm implanting the right thoughts. Every single day I'm doing what I need to do to continuously rise and continuously stay focused and to continuously shine. You know what I'm saying? So that's what Rise Nation is about. You know what I'm saying? Get, taking out the old, putting it in the new. And if you guys are with the new year or whatever, you want to get rid of the old you, 2017? Well, come on, man. Don't take a peek here in 2018. Use use this New Year's resolution. Use this this new day to tell yourself, "Hey, man, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start today." You should have started yesterday or a week ago. But today's the new day, 
and today's a new you and today's a new attitude you have a you have a you have a chance you have a choice to choose your attitude when you wake up you have an you have an opportunity to choose your attitude how you're going to re, how you're going to respond with life with how you're going to respond to others with instead of reacting so wake up and say hey man i'm going to have an amazing day i'm going to be powerful i'm going to be centered i'm going to be grounded i'm not going to let anything shake me i'm going to be i'm going to uh, um you know just ex what is the word i'm just going to be my best version just be my best self and just listen and be vulnerable and be understanding you know so you have an opportunity to choose your day just like you have a, an opportunity to whether or not to take a peek or to whether to go and do what you need to do to continuously rise higher you know what i'm saying so let's fucking do this shit let's continue to rise i'm on day i think 35 continuously going strong this might be my last video until a few weeks i don't know <clears throat> but like i said man i feel really good i feel really powerful and i'm shining and i'm rising man let's do this shit i'm out